Hey guys, Martin here from Mattress Clarity. Has this ever happened to you? You get on your comforter and it's flat or it's lumpy? When this happens, you can have cold spots or it can just be uncomfortable. But don't worry, here at Mattress Clarity, we have some clear steps to fluff and refluff your comforter. Let's get started. Okay, first there's some daily maintenance you can do to make sure your comforter never loses its fluff. First, you're gonna lay the comforter down flat on the mattress. You're gonna look for clumps and flat spots. When you find a clump, you're gonna grab it with your hands there and just carefully knead it. You're gonna break apart the fibers there, the filling, evenly dispersing it throughout the baffle box or the sewn through box here. In addition, if it's kind of a tough one, you can use the kind of palm of your hand here. You're just gonna carefully knead it and if you do this, you can ensure your comforter always stays fluffy. All right, another piece of daily maintenance you can do is you're actually gonna whip your comforter. Now by that I mean, you're gonna grab the ends from the bottom or the side. You're gonna try to create a wave motion throughout the comforter. So watch what I'm doing here. I'm gonna do that a couple times. And what it's doing is actually breaking apart the fill, similar to what I was doing with my hands earlier. In addition, it's also refluffing your comforter. Anyway, here we are outside. If your comforter gets lumpy or flat, you can also hang it out on the line. It's gonna do two things. It's gonna air out the comforter. In addition, it's gonna add some natural fluff. The thing to, know, to note is you wanna make sure it's not a humid day. It's gonna cause mildew and mold. Also make sure it's a breezier day like today. It's gonna help with that airflow too. All right, last but not least, you can use your dryer at home to fluff up your comforter. So how are you gonna do that? Of course, first, put your comforter in the dryer. In addition, take a tennis ball, a clean white sock, put it in the sock like that, make sure it's not gonna get any marks in the comforter. I'm gonna do three of those. I'm gonna put it in with my comforter in the dryer. It's gonna help bump around and help fluff the comforter as it's rolling through the dryer there. I'm gonna set it for 20 minutes on air dry only. Every 20 minutes, I'm taking the comforter out, I'm repositioning it. As it expands, I wanna make sure it's not getting scorch marks. So every 20 minutes repositioning until I, get, until I get the fluff that I want. I will note, if you have a kind of a larger comforter, definitely take it to a commercial washer at a laundromat or a washer and dryer. Make sure it has the room to expand and not get those scorch marks. And that about does it. If you follow these clear steps, it should be easy to fluff and refluff your comforter. If you're still a little bit confused, you want some more advice, just leave a comment below. If you want to see a list of my top picks for comforters, Google Mattress Clarity plus Best Comforter. Let me know if you have any questions.